Now, your 41 NBC AccuWeather forecast, presented by Volume Chevrolet. Welcome back. It has been a warm day across much of the area. Now that the sun's gone down, though, we've seen temperatures cooling off pretty quickly across middle Georgia. This looking out right now in the 41 sky view from the Houston County Galleria overlooking Center Park in Centerville. Today we have seen temperatures kind of ranging all over the place. We made it up to 75 degrees by this afternoon, but we started out today at 34. Now, I don't think it's going to be quite that cool heading into tomorrow morning, and we actually were not even close to that record. That record's 24 degrees set in 1967. So thankful we're not seeing 20s for this time of year, but we are going to continue to see some pretty cool evenings the next couple of days. Thanks to the clear skies, thanks to the high pressure before we get our next chance for some rainfall. Right now sitting at 41 in Dublin, seeing 42 in Eastman and 41 in Milledgeville as well as 43 over in Perry. So all of us down into the low 40s already. It's not super breezy, so we're not seeing much in the way of a wind chill at the moment. But we can expect a little bit more of that once we hit the weekend. We'll get to that in just a second. Right now, that high pressure we were talking about, it's keeping us clear here across the southeast. And that's going to be the story heading into tomorrow as well. This is eventually going to move further off to the east through the day tomorrow. So that means we're going to see that wind shift a little bit. So we're talking about some northwesterly winds through the day tomorrow. It's not going to be super breezy or anything like that, but you can see all this cloud cover that's going to head our way as high pressure moves out. So by Tuesday evening through the day on Wednesday, we're expecting to see a little bit more in the way of some partly cloudy skies. The bulk of this, though, is going to be high clouds, so it's not going to be anything that really impacts us in our area. We're going to keep those mid 70s through Tuesday and into Wednesday before we start to see kind of that big change come on as this cold front gets a little bit closer. So this is by Wednesday evening. You can see that still in parts of Missouri moving into Arkansas. We're not going to see the impacts until Thursday, and that's where we're also going to start to get our little bit of a cool down. For tonight, though, 42 degrees by around 1 a.m. We'll see those low 40s heading into early tomorrow morning as well. Once again, I do think some of us could end up seeing some upper 30s, but if you take a look at tomorrow during the day, it's going to be pretty much a repeat of what we saw today. 53 degrees to start the day at around 9 a.m., 71 by noon, and 75 by around 3 p.m. Enjoy this. Keep that warmth in your heart because... After this week, we have got a big cool down on the way, and this is where it's coming from. It starts with pulling in this moisture from the Gulf of Mexico. That's going to bring our first chance for some showers overnight Wednesday into early Thursday morning. As this front gets a little bit closer, it's going to bring that potential for some heavier rainfall to parts of middle Georgia. Uh, based off of everything that I've seen right now, we don't have a huge threat for severe storms or even thunderstorms at all just because of that instability. But once this starts to push through, we'll see some clearing on the way for Friday. So football games should be fine. That's before we get that real cold air to push through, which that's going to move in for Friday into Saturday. We are going to see another isolated chance for showers as we're moving into Sunday. So just something to be aware of, but it will be much cooler as we're heading into the end of the weekend and the start of next week. In just 10 seconds, I'll look at our seven day forecast. At Volume Chevrolet, good oil changes for life, plus a 20 year, 200,000 mile warranty. Visit Volume Chevrolet, I-75 exit 187 in Forsyth. That's volumechevrolet.com. It is your 41 NBC AccuWeather 7 day forecast sponsored by Volume Chevrolet. Mid 70s on the way for Tuesday, all the way through Thursday. Veterans Day, however, looks like it's going to be pretty rainy across the area. A few showers possible Friday morning. And then you see that big cool down Saturday. Highs in the 60s, Sunday highs in the upper 50s. We're going to stay in the 50s, looks like, into the start of next week.